Hello and welcome back to another Shadowlands Gold Farming video. Today I'm going to talk about how 2x4 farming is about to become even more crazy. And I think this will be the rebirth of 2x4 farming. And this is actually tied to the professions video I made before Shadowlands came out. And the thing is, we are getting access to stuff even faster than I thought. Because for example, as a Night Fae, you have access to this item called the Nature's Splendor. Now on beta, when I made my video, this was supposed to come down here, so at Renown 25, but we actually get it next week. So we get access to this on Wednesday, right? I'm currently Renown 9. I need one more Renown for this item or this bag chance, so I can get Nature's Splendor as a Night Fae, which gives me a chance to obtain leather, meat, and fish whenever I kill an enemy that yields experience or honor points. If you are any other Covenant than a Night Fae, then we can just take a look at the calculator on Wowhead. So you can see what you can get as well. So for example, we just go over here and we just look at the calculator. So for the Necro Lords, you have Bonesmith Hermir. And at the same place, you have the Bonesmith Satchel, which gives you a chance to get ore and gems whenever you kill an enemy. That gives you honor or experience. As a Venethyr, you pretty much have the same at Theotard the Mad Duke, where you have a chance of, of obtaining herbs and beverages and so on, whenever you kill an enemy as well. And as a Kyrian, you pretty much have the same thing, but for cloth. So you have Cleansed Vestments, which gives you a chance to obtain Cleansed Cloth and Enchanting Material, whenever you kill an enemy, that yields experience or honor points. And th that is pretty much it, that is like what you're getting access to starting already next week. And that would definitely re rebirth or revive 2x4 farming in general, making it much more viable because here's the thing, I've been testing this a bit on beta, killing like hundreds of mobs and so on, and you do get a couple of bags, like the thing you are getting is a bag, and when you open it then the bag itself will contain the materials tied to your covenant, so for me as a Night Fae, it will give me meat and leather, I think. Yeah, meat and leather. And some fish as well. And for anyone else, it's going to give you the stuff that you get access to. So you get a bag. And this bag has a pretty okay drop rate. I haven't farmed it and done actual testing. But I do believe I got like 20 bags or something on beta. I have like a video as well of me opening the bags. And on the beta, when I got my 20 banks, I only killed like a couple hundred enemies, maybe 1000 in total. I did everything so alone, didn't play for that much, but I tried to get some banks just to get some testing done, to see exactly what drops from them. And it does seem like it drops everything, but I haven't gotten any of the heavy callus hides, but you pretty much get all of the regular materials whenever you open them, right? And they have a pretty okay drop rate, and the thing about 2x4 farming is you're killing thousands of mobs every single hour, meaning you will get tons of those bags on an average. Especially, like, when it comes to those bags, right? You only need to think about how many mobs you're killing per hour, so let's say you get one bag every 500 kills. If you kill 5,000 mobs per hour, that means you are getting... One, not, well, not 100, that means you're getting 10 bags every single hour. Every single bag will contain a couple of meat and a couple of leather, and let's say 5 of each. The actual amount, I don't really know. But for this, you want to find a farm that gives you as many kills as possible. So that will definitely be the rebirth of 2x4 farming, because at that point, if you are a Night Fae, you can farm 2x4 for cloth and epics. And with that trait right there, which we get access to on Wednesday, you can also get meat, fish and leather while farming for cloth. So you are getting everything at the same time. It is definitely insane, I covered it pretty much in depth as well in my Shadowlands Professions video, the Professions guide I made before Shadowlands came out. But Blizzard has decided to do some rework on when we get access to stuff. So earlier we got access to a new conduit, at the point we now get access to this. So we are getting this even faster, which I don't really mind, because I love doing farming, so I was really getting I was really looking forward to getting this. So now we can do more 2x4 farming, get even more value for our time, and make even more gold per hour. And that is pretty much the video. I just wanted to update you guys so you know what's coming, and 2x4 will definitely be more popular starting on Wednesday, so be on the lookout for that. And I'm also going to shout out the sponsor of today's video, 
which is Stevie Dunn, you can check out his from CEDO to Gold Cap Guide as well in the description down below. And if you want to buy it, you can use my code to save 50%. So use the code Solheim to save 50% whenever you buy it. And that is pretty much it for the video. Leave a like down below, leave a comment, what do you think about this? Are you going to do 2x4 farming next week? I definitely am, so you can join my group if you want to. Join my Discord server through the link down below. Leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you haven't, and that is it. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you again very soon.